Hey guys, Swansea Batcave here with an unboxing video. Uh, it's going to be the first unboxing video of some Pokemon cards. Uh, so these are a new set that's come out quite recently, I believe. Um, so it's the what is it? The red and blue collection, uh, which is some really nice little box set with some Generations Pokemon packs, a foil Blastoise EX, and a giant card in the background. Um, flip it around. There you go. Blast off with Blastoise EX. It's one of the original superstars of the Pokemon world, celebrating 20 years of Pokemon with the Pokemon TCG Red and Blue collection. Uh, there is a Charizard version of this, which I think is in my local Toys R Us, which I need to pick up. And this is from, if you're in Swansea, it's from the Gamers Emporium. Lovely little shop. Uh, little. It's a lovely shop, a uh, game shop. Card it sells cards, board games. Things like that, models. But, um, yeah, so I haven't really, I haven't played Pokemon for about a year or so, and even then it was just a little bit. I don't know what the current meta is or anything like that. Um, when I initially was going to buy this, I thought the Generations packs, or at least it had been rumoured that the Generations packs were uh, repacks of base set one. And I thought it was an amazing nostalgia trip just to open some, but it turns out that's not correct. But still, it's going to be fun, so we're going to, well, we're going to open it. And we're going to see what's inside. So um, we'll have a brief jump, and I'll have everything out, and we'll see what's in there. Okay, so uh, we start off, the plastic cover comes off, and that's our Blastoise is held in there. I'll leave them in there for now. Uh, we then get a Pikachu cut pack of Generations, a Blastoise pack, and uh, what is this? Online rewards await. Um, actually, I'll tell you what, I'm going to put it up. Uh, there is a QR code and a code there. Whoever gets it first gets whatever whatever it is you get on the Pokemon TCG website. There you go. Okay, now we have a Charizard pack. Very cool. And a Venusaur pack. Hey! So that's, uh, yeah, the starters from the original red and blue. And the start from yellow. Very cool. And then in the background of this pack, if I can get them out. It's very difficult to store. This is worse than the Commander cards. It's huge! And it is the Blastoise EX promo card. So we're going to see him in the back. Might get a nice frame for him. Let's see if I can bring the camera back a little bit. Okay. Actually, if I point this here. Ah, there we go. We can open some booster packs and see what we get inside. So let's see. The first pack is Pikachu! Now, should we go in order? Uh, yeah. Okay. So we will save Blastoise for last because it's his pack. We will open, we'll open Charizard because he is an overrated base set Pokemon card. When I remember, um, I was like, oh, he's so expensive, he's worth a lot of money. He's not. This is a terrible pack. Right, there we go, let's have a look here. So, uh, we have a, again, I don't know rarities or how good cards are. I'm just going to do this because I really enjoy Pokemon. I like the series, I like the toys. I like the universe, and I love the card game. It's a very well thought out card game. Uh, if you're wondering what the noise in the background is, that is a cat with a magic up, epic splash. Have a steel energy, I think. Have a Pikachu. Ooh, we have a foil magma, and a oh, this looks cool. Sylveon EX in foil. Look how cool that is. It's got some really nice colours on it. It's got little bows down the side, a little book. I have no idea what's going on with this card. It's amazing. That's so cool. So that's our rare, right? Oh no, oh, and we have a Snorlax. Hey, how cool is that? And we have a Rabafat, a Pokemon fan club, and a Pokeball. Yes, hello cats. That is the cats. So that was, I think that was a good pack opening. I'm not sure. Um, it looks like it's a good pack opening. I'm just going to take the cats outside, and cats are now gone. So yeah, um, I think it was a good pack. Um, that seems like a fun card. It seems like it's very colourful, and it's got EX on it, which means it's it, you have to. I don't know how it works, but still very cool. Really like Sylveon. Um, I think it's what I evolved my EV to in. X and Y. I think I got, I think I got Y, didn't I? No, I think I got X. The one with the reindeer uh, thing. Uh, let's see, we'll open Venusaur next. 
Okay, let's have a look. So we start with a do this that way. We have got a tangler there again. Ghastly. Have a psychic energy. A crabby. A foil fighting energy. <gasps> Ooh. And an uncommon Jirachi. Again, there's a little bow. Oh, is that just because it's a psychic type, or is there actually a th what that means? I don't know. Um, isn't Jirachi? Um, is it one of the legendary Pokemon in the new newer sets? I'm not sure. Uh, we have a rare. It's a Doug Trio. Very cool. A Gulpin. <laughs> Some nice artwork. Uh, Team Flare Grunt, and a Clement. Oh, he's in the new series. I think I've watched like a couple of episodes. He's an inventory chap. Very cool, though. So that was our rare. That is a Doug Trio to go with our Sylveon and our Snorlax. We'll put those over there. So I think the foil then has a chance to be a rare or not. So we need multiple foils per pack. We'll stick Jirachi over with the rares over there because I, uh, I really like it as a card. There we go. All right, so... Um, Moving on from red and blue as Game Boy games. Next was Pokemon Yellow, where we got to experience having a Pikachu and all of the difficulty that having a Pikachu entailed. So we have a ghastly Krabby, uh, electric energy, yeah. Slowpoke. Ooh, their foil crushing hammer. That's very shiny. And, ooh. Okay, our oh an uncommon again. There's these little down the side. This looks cool, isn't it? Al Altaria, which is like a cloud Pokemon, right? There we go. That's very pretty. I like the little stuff in the background. Uncommon, and then our rare. Oh, it's a Hitmonchan. <laughs> very cool. And then we have a <laughs> Floral Crown. Um, maintenance, and oh a Persian right at the back. There doesn't seem to be any order to the packs, which is you know it's interesting. It's like coming from opening Magic the Gathering packs where you sort of have a certain order to them. We've got like there's an uncommon, there's an uncommon. The foils just seem to be scattered throughout it. I don't know. It's very cool though. Uh right, so now we're on to the uh well the name of the pack. This is the Blastoise pack to go with our Blastoise. EX Giant Card. It's very cool. I love Giant Cards. I think you used to get the Giant promo cards when you bought a booster box. If I'm, remem rem if I'm remembering it right. I may have just been making that up or I was told it and it's not real. Uh, so we have a Zubat. Steel Energy. We have another Magma. Very cool. Oh, it's Paris. Paris. Oh, and a load of foils just come up. So we have a Hitmon Lee. To go with our Hitman Chan, very, very cool. And in foil, that is our rare. And then we have a Frostlass in foil. Very pretty. Look at that. Is Frostlass the one that's like a dead person, like roaming the mountains? Can't remember what the backstory. Some of their backstories are very dark. Put that down here with the other foils. We have a Parasect to go with our Paris. We have a Charmeleon. It's, again, these little Symbols, no idea what they mean. Um, have Shauna, who is again in the new series that was on Netflix, and an Evo Soda. <laughs> so that was all very cool. Um, we'll go over what we got again. So there's a couple of foils and things in there that are quite cool. Let's shuffle through. Where are you all? It's very cool that we got some really nice base set Pokemon. So stuff that was in the original games. Not too much from the newer ones, but. Yeah, it's very cool. So, uh, we have a foil fighting energy, foil crushing hammer. What does it do? Um, flip a coin. If heads, discard an energy attached to one of your opponent's Pokemon. So I can see maybe, a, I don't know, like without knowing anything, maybe a deck around depleting your opponent's energy. Uh, yeah. Have a Frostlass. Uh, so if this Pokemon is your active Pokemon and it's knocked out by damage from an opponent's attack, flip a coin. If heads, the attacking Pokemon is knocked out. So it's quite cool. It's fun and it has Snowy Drop. Put four damage counters on your opponent Pokemon in Pokemon opponent's Pokemon in any way you like. It's quite cool. Uh, we have a Hitmon Lee. Uh, so he has Stretch Kick because of his stretchy legs. Um, 
This attack does 30 damage to one of your opponent's benched Pokémon and he has Spiral Kick. That's quite cool. Have a Foil Magma. That's a common, but still you have Ram and Ember. That's cool. We have... What else do we get? Snorlax. <laughs> Very cool. Stare and Snooze. If this Pokémon is asleep, flip two coins instead of one between turns. If either of them is tails, still asleep. <laughs> So, yeah, it can do Sleepy Press, which um, puts itself to sleep, heals 20 damage, and does 120 damage. So it's quite it's quite cool if you can get him to wake back up, I suppose. Uh, we had a Doug Trio. Very fun. So he has... I can't get to focus properly. Uh, let's see. He has Earthquake. This attack does 10, 10 damage to each of your opponent's bench Pokémon and Rock Tumble. We had a shiny foil Jirachi, which is a uncommon as Wish. Search your deck for a card and put it into your hand. That seems quite good. And it's got 50 attack for Heart Sign. Um, we had a Altaria, which is a uncommon as Flap and Fairy Friend. If you have any fairy Pokemon on your bench, this attack does 30 more damage. So it's like a. That's very cool. Um, what else do we have? Yeah, because the um, before fairy energy and stuff was introduced, it was they were just normal Pokemon, so things like Clefairy, Jigglypuff. Yeah, so that makes sense that there's that sort of synergy between them. We had a Hitmonchan to go with a Hitmonlee. Bullet Punch, flip two coins. This attack does 20 more damage for each heads. Very cool. And then our one of my favorite things we've got out of this, this uh, pack is. Sylveon EX, if you can get the light to stop. <laughs> so it's Dress Up. If this Pokemon has a Pokemon Tool card attached to it, it does attack does 30 more damage. And Precious Ribbon, move a Fairy Energy from this Pokemon to one of your bench Pokemon. If you do, heal 50 damage from that Pokemon. That's very cool. So there's the little EX thing say at the bottom. Uh, when a Pokemon EX has been knocked out, your opponent takes two prize cards. Ah, that's cool. Well then. So that was the opening of the Blastoise EX Red and Blue Edition. There we go. These are retailing for, a I got this for £16.20. I think it's about £16, £17, £18 for the box. I would buy more of these. I think I may go pick up the Charizard box. Um, not sure if they're going to do any more anniversary things. I know there's some toys that are out for the, uh, the 20 year anniversary. There's some special gold boxes with Pikachu and some other Pokemon in. Uh, but yeah, that was a that was the Pokemon EX Blastoise unboxing. If you like this sort of thing, tell me. I can do more. Um, yeah, as usual, a like down there, subscribe, whichever way they're around. Uh, do that thing. Liking it knows that makes me know that I've done a good video, and subscribing means that I have more in well more subscribers. It's always good, and if I can get a certain amount of them, I can do more videos. Uh, so thanks for watching, guys. Uh, I'll see you again soon. Bye bye.